This is George David Clark reading Jellyfish. Jellyfish. The dark sea dreams them. They are the unexchangeable currency of dreams. The interest the other world pays and pays into this one. In the pre-dawn blue they seem hume out from the littoral like great waterlogged diamonds, an interior gleam. Who speaks for them speaks for the secret side of the womb, for they are the long-tasseled death bonnets of children we conceive but never bring to term, and so we love and jointly curse them. It is impossible now to tell if they reach for us or we for them, so strange is their volatile gravity. They are sisters to the moon, then, and pulse in her wake, a curdled blooming of echoes as she, too, is an echo. But in the fluorescent pink and green pockets of their bodies, softer than night, their smuggling rumors of those suns we fail to imagine. They hold whole oceans above their umbrellas. Tell me, friend, is there an end to revelation? The poison flowers blossom inside us like Rorschachs we might believe in. Evening and thunderheads in the austral sky. The jellyfish tides, an exhibition of lightnings and scaled-down Hiroshima's. If they proceed like messengers, another breed of angel, then it falls on us to hear and heed them, their cold Medusa bells resounding, calling us back through the black sand of sleep.